Hello everyone, this is Ravius Blog, and welcome to another movie news roundup series. So we got a lot of movie news happening this week, but before I get into that, here are a few words from the channel. Alright everybody, it's time to get on the social media train. Wanna chat with me in a hundred words or less? Then check out my Twitter account. Wanna talk about movies, TV shows, and video games within the group? Then check out my Facebook account. Wanna check out some of my ultra cool fan art? Then check out my deviant art page. Want to get the lowdown on everything that's happening on this channel? Then check all of the above. And now, we return to our regularly scheduled program. So before I get into this week's movie news, I wanted to let everybody know that we're this close to hitting 600 subscribers for this channel. We got about 50 more subscribers to go until we hit 600 subscribers for this channel. So if we hit 600 subscribers for this channel, I will host a special Q&A for you guys, but I'll go more into detail about that once we hit 600 subscribers. So if you guys want to hear me ramble about movies or TV shows and video games, please feel free to hit that subscribe button and help us reach up to 600 subscribers for this channel. And now let's get into this week's movie news. So Paramount had released a tweet a week ago, and in this tweet, it talks about the Sonic the Hedgehog movie franchise, and the tweet states, Sonic Movie 3 is officially in development from Paramount Pictures and Sega. Plus, next year, a new original Knuckles series with Ildris Elba is coming to Paramount+. Plus. Sonic Movie 2 hits theaters April 8th. Now it's time to go into thoughts for the day while I talk about my thoughts on this week's movie news. So what are my thoughts about this week's movie news? I'm really excited about all this. I was really looking forward to seeing Sonic the Hedgehog 3, and I'm really excited about this new Knuckles TV series that we'll be getting with Paramount+. Plus. And the reason why I'm so excited about all this is because I'm a huge Sonic the Hedgehog fan, so of course I want to see more from Sonic the Hedgehog in the movie-verse. And I really enjoyed the first movie for Sonic the Hedgehog, and i like to see more characters from the Sonic the Hedgehog video games come into the movies. Like, I would like to see Shao the Hedgehog make an appearance, or maybe Amy Rose make an appearance or maybe have Omega or maybe E Gamma make an appearance in this game whoever they choose to put into the movies I'm really looking forward to seeing these characters on the big screen and that's why I'm so excited to see Sonic Movie 3 to see what characters they're going to introduce into the big screen next and as for the Knuckles TV series, I'm really excited about this because Knuckles is one of my all-time favorite characters from the Sonic the Hedgehog franchise, and I'd like to see what they're going to do with Knuckles' character in this TV series. Like, is this going to be a prequel series where it explains about what Knuckles' backstory is all about before he meets Sonic and Dr. Robotnik? Or is this going to be taking place after Sonic the Hedgehog 2, where we see Knuckles hanging out with Sonic and those, or maybe seeing Knuckles go on a treasure hunt by himself? Who knows what the Knuckles TV series is going to be all about. Now, even though I'm really excited about this news, I am a bit mixed about Paramount announcing this news a bit too soon. Like, as of this video, Sonic the Hedgehog 2 hasn't come to theaters yet, so we really don't know how this movie is going to do in box office, and we don't know if Paramount may have jumped the gun a bit too soon in releasing this news. Like, we need to see how Sonic the Hedgehog 2 does in theaters first to see if it warrants a third movie or even a TV series starring Knuckles the Echidna. I personally hope that Sonic the Hedgehog 2 does very well in theaters because again, I want to see Sonic the Hedgehog 3 and I want to see this Knuckles TV series. So I really hope that Sonic the Hedgehog 2 does well in theaters for that reason. And I am interested to see how Sonic the Hedgehog 2 is going to be doing in theaters when it comes out in April. So we have to wait and see how Sonic the Hedgehog 2 does in theaters so I'm hoping the movie does very well but overall I really love this news I like the fact that Paramount is much more confident with this franchise than they were when the first movie came out so now they got some plans about what they're going to do with the Sonic the Hedgehog brand moving forward and I enjoy seeing that and I can't wait to see Sonic the Hedgehog 3 and that new Knuckles TV series whenever it comes out so that's it for this week's movie news and let me know in the comments down below what do you guys think about this week's movie news are you excited for Sonic the Hedgehog 3 and for the new Knuckles TV series and do you think that Paramount may have announced the news a bit too soon or do you think this is the right time to announce this news please let me know in the comments down below well I hope you guys enjoyed this video this is Rowdy's blog and I'll see you guys later